What makes Maharshi's approach, these groups, these lighthouses, better than having people in a country praying in their churches for peace? Praying is also on different levels. Prayer is always the path to God-realization. Prayer is also the path to realization. A man with the bicycle goes on the highway. A man with a, a little bigger bicycle or a car. A man with faster speed train. So all are on the same road. One goes slow or one goes faster, depending on what he drives on, what he picks up. Prayer from the verbal level has its effectiveness. Prayer from the mental level has its own level of effectiveness. Much finer field of, uh, of experience. Prayer from transcendental meditation, entering into the transcendental area, that has the maximum field because that is a field of frictionless flow. Any little impulse from that most basic transcendental field from the self is penetrating. It travels throughout the universe, travels throughout nature. Depends on from what level of awareness one projects one's prayer to God. Every religion in different wordings, in different, in different phrases, is talking about transcendental prayer. Prayer from the transcendental level is instantly heard and instantly responded. The value of prayer cannot be uh, undermined. The value of prayer can never be uh, spoken enough. It is the way, it is the way to realization depending on what level of speech or thought we pray. Transcendental meditation can be talked completely in terms of prayer. Any prayer, if it is from the finest level of intelligence, from that which Dr. Hagelin says, unified field level of reality, where total natural law is fully awake, prayer from there is a direct opening direct entering into the open door. It's, and in some grosser levels of prayer, you knock and the door will be opened. You have to knock and the door will be opened. No prayer will go in vain. Absolutely no prayer will go in vain, only depending on what level, how frictionless level promotes our thought of prayer to God, this God, this God. So that is a very, very, very fortunate field of approaching God. Some people call it devotion, some people call it prayer, doesn't matter what one calls, it's the same thing. And God realization is the supreme level of realization. It is in unity consciousness. Unity consciousness is unified wholeness where the thought propagates in the whole creation instantly. An impulse here is an impulse everywhere on that level of unity consciousness, on that level of prayer. Oh, prayer is absolutely glorious field of life. It's a technique of living. It's a technique of living. It's a technique of living. In whatever word we talk about it, in its glory, the glory of prayer can never be glorified in human consciousness enough. 
It's a supreme value of life, huh?